How's it going everybody? Lucian here bringing you another tutorial video. In this tutorial I'm going to show you guys how to set up any game server as a service. This way it will allow you to do auto restarts and if your server, your actual server, such as your Ubuntu server, crashes when it restarts or if, even if you have to manually turn it back on, your actual game server or servers will automatically boot back up. Now I'm going to use this example on Power World because that's what I already have set up in my machine here. However, you can do this for any game server you're running on Linux. All you got to do is just change a couple things around. So to go ahead and get started, we are going to create a file for the service. And I'm just going to copy and paste my commands in here. And I'll have all the commands down in the description below for everybody. So in my case, like I said, I'm doing Power World. So I'm calling it powerworld.service. If you're running another server like enshrouded or whatever, you just call it enshrouded.service. Then we're going to hit enter. And then in here, I have another thing I'm going to copy and paste over again. Anything that I'm copy and pasting, <coughs> we'll have it in the description. So I'll paste that in here. So my description is Power World Server. Again, if you're running this on another server, not Power World, you can rename this. Then the path. Make sure that you do it to your path. If your path isn't exactly like mine, where it's home, it's home slash whatever, if it's something different, make sure you change the path. Right here is very important. No matter what server you're running, change the path. Then once that's done, you're gonna hit Control X, and then Y, then Enter. And then we are going to reload the daemon. So, sudo systemctl daemon reload. We're gonna hit Enter on that. And then we need to enable our server. So we'll do sudo systemctl enable world that service the hit enter that enables the service and now we need to start the server service so we'll do sudo the system ctl start power that service enter and that starts the service <clears throat> now we can check the status of that service by doing the same thing except for we're going to do status power that service and then hit enter. Then you see our server is actually running. So now if we want, we need to create a uh, cron job for this. So it automatically restarts. We'll do it every 12 hours. So we'll do uh, cron tab minus E. Scroll all the way down to the bottom. Then we do our cron job. I'm going to copy and paste mine in. This makes it a little bit easier. Again, I'll have this down below. So this right here, with this setting right here, this restarts at every 12 hours. If you wanted to restart every six hours or eight hours or maybe even once a day, you change the settings here. And then once you're done, do control X, Y, enter. And that's it. That's all you got to do. Server will now restart every 12 hours. And if my actual Ubuntu server here crashes, the server will come back up without me having to worry about anything. It's all automatic. And that's going to be it for this video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'll see you on the next one.